Hello guys, this is Charlie from Outcast Gaming here, and I'm back with another GT5 being deer. Today I'm going to be sharing, showing you how to duplicate and sell cars on GTA 5 patch um, 1.11. Um, for this glitch guys, you're going to need 15 grand. You're going to need the journey, which I'll show you now. So you go to travel and transport, wall stock, not wall stock, no, it's wall stock, yeah. Sorry guys. And then down to the journey, 15 grand. So you're going to need a total of 30 grand start starting off to complete this. So you're going to want to exit your garage in any vehicle and then call up Pegasus. Hello, this is Pegasus Lifestyle Management. How can I help? You're going to want to call in the Great. journey so and make sure it's done delivered to, to the Chinese strip. Now you're just going to want to drive up there and get in your car. Once you reach it, if you've done, done it right, the journey should spawn on either the left side or the right side of the road. Here you go. You're going to want to park your vehicle, if it's this side, against this tree here, as far as you can, and hop out. You're then going to want to jump in the journey and drive it back down towards your garage. So you're just going to want to head back down to wherever your, your apartment is. The only thing that you need to do is make, make sure the journey spawns up on this Chinese strip here. Now guys, you, you can use other large Pegasus for vehicles, but the journey has an almost 100% rate, so that's your best option. Now, with my apartment, which is the 400 gram one, people are having problems. I found out this because of multiple videos that, that I've seen of it. Um, you you basically have to block up this garage door um, by parking the journey against it. So it's like a block so it can't open. I find the best place is against this wall on the left side. So you're going to want to get it right in there. There you go. You're going to want it so your bumper is actually going through the garage door. Some people like to park to the right of me over on the right side or in the center so you 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 guys may have to try out all all of these options before you find the one that's right for you you're going you're going to want to hop out and you'll be stood stood here and you're going to want to walk into your garage now you should see the bumper of the journey down in the right hand corner now you're going to want to pick the car that you have the most upgrades on so for me that would be my entity. Now you're, you're not going to be selling your car for the full price, just the price of the upgrades that you've put on it. So you're going to want to drive, drive out and if you've done, done this correctly there should be no um, animation of you driving out, you, sh you should just spawn here, which I've done, done right. I'm going to leave the armor truck for, for now, guys. Now you're going to want to call up Moore's Mutual. If you've done this correctly, Moore's the entity Mutual should be in there. How can we help you? When I pay for this now, sure. Um, this entity has been duped. So, if you had a spare space in your garage, you could drive this in there now, and that's it done. Okay, but I don't, guys. So. I'm going to leave it like that. Right now, if you want to sell the car, you're going to want to buy, go to Travel and Transport, then Southern um, San Andreas Autos. You're going to want to come down to the Carrion Remo. You're going to want to buy it any colour, and you want to have it delivered to your garage. So I'm going to replace the injection for this. 
Now you're going to want to drive down to the closest um, Miss Santos Customs. For me, that's the one just down this road. When you're here, I want you to park outside the garage door. Just so the door doesn't open, but you're just park parked outside it. Now you're going to want to go to your contacts, then your mechanic. Wait for him to pick up. And then you're going to want to call in the carry level. It's coming at you. As soon as this appears on the map, you can drive it into the garage and sell it. There you go. So as you guys can see, it's now appeared on my mini map, so I can drive this car in and set it. If you don't complete that step and still sell your car, it's gone. Sorry guys, I have explained it in the video, so don't get arsy if it's gone or gone wrong. So if you followed all the um, examples that I've um, created, you should be able to now sell your car for the upgrade price. Sell it. There you go. As you can see in the top right, I've just got 124k, and that, that's it, guys. That's really it. That's how easy it is. Um, I'll be bringing out some more legit ways to do um, to make money in GTA 5. And if you weren't here when I said it before, check check out my mate Tyler Stock's channel. He's put, put up a 250 grand my money guide for level 75 and over. All right, I'm I'm going to be creating one for 24 and over and 35 and over. Alright guys, see you guys later and peace out.